Let's get this big mandolin now. Okay, guys. Hello, good morning everyone. I'm Adi from Black Soldier Fly Colony and back with me again today. I'm at the farm now and today we are here doing maintaining of my farm because you know uh, I built this farm maybe four years uh, since 20... I started to build this farm since 2014 yeah. I built this farm six years ago and there's some part I have to I have to change and some part I have to replace and today I have some pre pupae and pupae here where I want to show to you yeah this is related to my previous video about pre pupae and pupae I have pupae and some of them has turned into pupae here I have some several bins here of pre pupae and I will put them inside the fly cage and also the fly cage is being maintaining now Okay hey guys, you can see two kind of pre pupa here. Why they call pre pupae? Because they are in the stage before turn into pupae. Pre pupae, the skin color has black already like this, where the young larvae has the color of white, yellow and brownish. Yeah. Okay, I have. I want to show you a pre pupae here. Uh, okay. Okay, this is pre pupae with black color of the skin, and then they still move. They still move, and they, and in this stage, they don't eat. Yeah, like young larvae. So. When the young larvae turn into pre pupae, they will leave the culture, they will leave the biopons, and they don't need food anymore. Look, here in my hand I have some pre pupae here, they're still moving. And some of them has turned into pupae where the pupae is like this yeah the the skin is getting hard like this and they don't move in this stage look they don't move now they are is now in the pupae stage and in this pupae stage within days He's ready to emerge into flies. four pupae in my hand they are freezing they are freeze down and don't move and they are within this are ready to emerge into flies so I told so as I told you in my previous video we can use this pre pupae or pupae as a seed 
to start our initial stage in black soldier flies cultivations. the diagrams of the uh, the cycle of black like, soldier flies they are mating mating and then this stage is in the fly cage and below this stage all this stage is in the biopones here and this stage above this is the life cycles of flies inside the fly cage. So when they are emerge to flies, they will mating and then some females will laying eggs. Uh, you can see here the amount of the eggs per females is 500 to 900 but uh, according to my experience per cluster you mean it's mean one female will laying eggs uh, in theory five to nine hundred but in my experience they will laying eggs per females is seven hundred so seven hundreds will 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 make some cluster we call this some cluster one cluster one female one cluster and then once the eggs hatch uh, you will have a baby larvae and then grow 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 and then the baby larvae the young larvae will turn into prepupae uh, uh, according to my experience since 18 days of days old 18 days old of the young larvae will turn into prepupae and then back to pupae and prepupae uh, prepupae and pupae and then the pupae is within days they are, they are they are ready to emerge into flies. This is the flies, male, female, male. This is the difference between uh, male at the tail and then the female. <clears throat> Now you know about the difference about uh, prepupae and pupae. Yeah? Well, pu prepupae is the stage before pupae. They are still move. They don't eat. The colored skin is black, and they still have a character. When this beans is wet, they still can climb here. The prepupae still moving, yeah. But when they are once they are turned into pupae, they will freeze like this they don't move and within days in theory in, in in three days they will emerge into fly but in my experience sometimes more than three days so I have fly cage here and as you can see uh, some of these wire mess is I have to repair like this we have to cover this Fly skates very good like this. This hole can make the lizard come in and this is the predator the predator of the flies. And spiders also can come in and predators uh, and lizard spiders is one predator of the flies. So Today we are doing maintaining this farming, this farm, yeah. So today we are doing maintaining the farm in Indonesia now, starting the BSF cultivations by preparing by providing uh, two seeds, yeah. We uh, they can start from pre pupae they can start from the eggs. In Indonesia now, many farmers provide also for new beginners who want to start the cultivations 
I start to do this farming since seven years ago and yeah I provide to many farmers in Indonesia and then in, in Indonesia now a lot of a lot of people providing for yeah selling they are they are sell uh, seeds in Indonesia so starting in Indonesia now is very easy yeah uh, as I told you before in my previous video to start cultivations we can start from pre pupae we can start from the from the eggs yeah as a seed I I divide this cultivations whole this cultivation in two two parts one one is uh, BSF cultivation which is we we cultivate the flies in the fly cage and then the next is maggot cultivations while in this stage we hatch the eggs uh, grow the, the baby larvae grow the baby larvae until we harvest okay guys this is a short video for me I have time a bit and I made this video and yeah I still have this video this short video is is useful for you yeah okay guys see you in the next video thank you bye